Within Adyen, we have a specific way of working together. We have actually captured it in what we call the Adyen formula. We don't have a supplier relationship with our merchants. It feels more like a partnership because we can make an impact and they want us to make an impact. So there's much more harmony in that relationship as well. Because what you have internally, working well together and being able to deliver something is reflected in what we do with our merchants. What we do with Altien is we build something for a very long term. And that means that we give ourselves the opportunity to build it in a way where we don't compromise on many things. That means that you can build an ethical business, that you can work with merchants that you never have to be ashamed of, but that you actually are proud of that those are your partners. For an engineering company, it's very important that the engineers see the impact that they make but also avoid the situation that if we build something really good and the merchant really likes it, it should not be just the commercial people who say like, wow, look how we implemented this and how happy the merchant is. But then also the engineering side should feel, this is what we built and see how happy the merchant is with it. And that's if you go back to the Adyen formula, where we say winning is more important than ego, we win as a company. If we don't know something, if we disagree on something, we take the time because we have a group of people that's very smart and probably if people look differently at a certain topic, have different opinions, we should spend time on it to understand why somebody thinks differently about it. Because only if you do that, then you understand why somebody has different assumptions or maybe an error in the thinking or maybe an error in your own thinking. And only that can help to get to a very good outcome. At Adyen, we have offices around the globe. So if we all go to work between nine and five and keep it limited to that, there's too little overlap to pick up the phone and to have a proper discussion with each other. Because we want to have communication, not over email, but picking up the phone. If you look at how you want to organize yourself, what we feel is it's important that people can have a high contribution. We say we want to help our merchants grow. We don't accept the payment industry as is. We want to change it. But thirdly, we say we want to have fun whilst doing it. We're in a hurry as a company. We want to make very quick iterations and constantly we want to deliver the next iteration in our product to surprise the market like, wow, this is new, this is really cool. The company Adyen is started in Amsterdam, started by the three founders and we're all Dutch. And the Dutch are known for being very direct, sometimes to the point that people will say, oh, that could be rude. When we were defining the Adyen formula, that one came back. Where do we want to be on the scale of directness? Talking straight without being rude in Brazil is not the same as talking straight without being rude in Singapore. So we ask people, incorporate in your own culture, but within what is acceptable within your culture, we think you should be on the more direct side so that the merchant actually feels there's a lot of transparency. That is something which we had from the beginning, but I think it scales. I think we can keep it for a very, very long time that way.